Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ4 Ray, and welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. I've just been stocking and stocking and stocking some more, and I think I'm ready to run another day here. I've ran a few days, and um, my money's been pretty high. It's been in the high 4Ks to, you know, up into the 5K sometimes. A couple times I hit 5K. One time I almost got 6K. I got like 5,900, which is pretty dope. So I'm going to keep on plugging along here. I am saving up for a store expansion. I would like to get it today, but that's not guaranteed because, um, you know, the money comes in a little slow in this game. You don't really you don't really make as much money on product as I thought you would. Um, when I worked at the bagel store, my boss said he always liked to try to uh, charge double on most of the things in the store. But in this game, it's not it's not really like that. Like rice, um, my average cost is $4.40. I'm charging that much, so I'm not making double on that. Um, do you make double on anything? No, definitely not making double on that. I don't know. Do you make double your money on anything in the game? Um, oh, okay. Profit, 196. Okay, so the cheese is good on doubling the money. That cheese is close. Yeah, and that cheese is close as well. So cheese, cheese seems pretty good. Cheese seems pretty good. It cost me 337 I make almost th that money back double. And that, that's what I'm looking for. Um, so it is what it is. You know, it's a... Hey, hey. It's a fun game. So if I just got to play this game all day, then so be it. I'm having a good time. We're going to ring some people up today. I'm looking forward to see my peeps again, especially Psycho Sid. I'm a huge fan. And um, yeah, we're just going to you know take care of some business and make some money. I'm trying to hit store level 70, and I'm trying to get enough for store expansions. The store expansions are going to start at 25,000. So let's get this show on the road. Go. I have not rung anyone up off camera. I say that strictly for you guys. All right, that looks pretty good. All right, that looks good right there. While I'm waiting, I guess I will order some more stuff. I'm trying not to order stuff unless it's completely out. Um, I've been ordering a lot of stuff, and I mean, there, it doesn't really matter if you order stuff and keep it in the back. Uh, but you'll make your profits later, a little bit later, if you order things you don't need. You'll still make the profits. It'll just be a little bit later, so... Um, I'd like to make the profits earlier if I can. Plus, it's less ordering. So, well, is it? If I order two things, two, let's say I need olive oil, I order two. And then I order another two the day after tomorrow. Or I order four right now, and then I don't order any for another four days. I don't know. Which one's better? Honestly, I kind of go back and forth on it. it. Just I think everyone has their own way of playing. And um, for me personally, I just go back and forth on it. Maybe some days I will... Order those two items, and sometimes I won't, and, you know, off the water again a little bit earlier, but, yeah, it is what it is. Let's get this stuff away. Maybe we go through a lot of olive oil, dude, for real. I'm, I'm, kind of, I'm a little surprised. I'm a little off-put by how much olive oil we go through, but that's okay. That's okay. We're getting some more stocked. We gotta get these cakes stocked. I prefer not to run out of anything. A lot of people in the comments seem to think that Having your, your your shelves completely stocked will make a difference. And I'm not saying it doesn't, but if it does, that doesn't make any sense. If you have 12 spots for toilet paper. No, let's say, let's say you have 24 spots for toilet paper. And you put and you use 12 of those 24 spots. You fill up the 12 spots. Uh, there's another 12 spots empty. And, you know, that's all you ever stock, right? If you don't run out of toilet paper, then it should make no difference. Because the toilet paper is there for people to buy. Whether it's 24 rolls or 12 rolls, it's still there. So, I don't know. I mean, unless there's some... What? Did I, I thought I hit the third one. Let's try it again. Cool. Thank you very much. Have a good day. So, yeah, I mean, that doesn't... If that is the way that works, and I'm not sure it is, then that doesn't make any sense. Like, unless you're just saying, if someone sees 24 rolls of toilet paper instead of 12, they're, they're maybe liable to buy more or something? I, I have no idea. I have no idea, but that doesn't that doesn't seem to make sense to me at all. So, um, there we go. Let's buy three bleach and another three bleach. And what else? Only buy stuff that we're out of. French fries. French fries. And that's great, because we're going to buy four. All right, cool. We need to run a couple days. It's probably not buy anything. Like, honestly. <laughs> Keep buying stuff. I don't make any money. Although, again, if it's in the back, theoretically, it shouldn't really matter. Um, 61 75. Have a good day. All right. What's up, man? What does this guy look like? An Ernie? Let's call this guy Ernie. All right, Ernie. Looking good, bud. 
119 is your total. Have a good day. Good old Ernie. All right. Bleach, bleach, bleach. French fries, French fries, French fries. Okay. Anybody know where the hamburger was was uh was first made? Hamburger, at least as far as I know. Let me know in the comments. Who knows where who knows where the hamburger was invented? At least as far as I know. <laughs> I like say stuff on the internet. People are like, nope, that's not right. And I'm like, freaking stupid internet lying to me all the time. Not you, not you guys, but where I got my information from. But I think it's it makes sense. So I think it's accurate. How's it going, lady? What do you got here? You got some bread. You got some of these pastries. Some sugar. Some uh, pizzas. I like it. Oops. Uh, da, 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 25. Have a good day. I haven't rung on anybody up in a while. I don't bring people up unless I don't bring people up unless you guys are watching. I save it all for you guys. Do we have bleach already? Wait, is that another thing of bleach out there? If it is, I bought too many. Nope, I bought enough. Bought exactly the right amount. French fries are stocked. Hey, how's it going, man? Looks like Ernie took his glasses off. Uh, there you go, exact change. Have a good day. Hello, ma'am. All right, pizza and bleach. I love it. Gotta wash that peachy down with some bleach. Have a good day. Okay, so nothing there. So what else should we buy? I don't see anything that's out yet. Uh, no, everything's looking stocked. Up, oh, up. Oh. Okay, yogurt. Buy a few things of yogurt because you could fit a lot up there. I'm gonna buy six. And then um. Elbow pasta. Pa uh, pasta. Yeah, my, my fingers aren't going in the right spots today. Oh, God, that sounded, that sounded really awful. I'm sorry. I am really sorry, people. Let's go turn on that light. All right. Ah. Hey, what's going on, man? How's it going? All right. Dude, dude, that red juice makes me thirsty in real life. Or whatever, that red soda, it really makes me thirsty. Have a nice day. What's up? I don't remember what I called you. See, I'm not going to remember the names. It's a problem. You sent, so you go. Have a nice day, person I don't know your name. Oh, look at the whiskey. Ah, oh, whiskey man. Whiskey and chocolate. Oh, see, now, doesn't this, doesn't this make you thirsty? Like, I'm getting thirsty just looking at it. All right. He's like, stop drooling over my items and ring me up. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Have a good day. All right. Elbow macaroni. Elbow macaroni. That's my favorite. That's all I really eat. Like elbow macaroni. Love it. Love it. Just, just you know, cook it. Get some, get some, uh, some red pasta sauce, and maybe some uh, of that Parmesan cheese. You know, to kind of like keep in the refrigerator, and uh, I'm good to go. You can even have to eat that on a diet. You just gotta um, measure it out and you know put all the you know carbohydrate or not carbohydrates, but put all the uh, calories in there. Make sure you add it into your calories for the for the intake. If you measure it out, you pasta can be pretty filling in very small amounts. So I'm not one of those like uh, you know carnivore diet people or Atkins or whatever the new one's called. Um, that's not my thing. I, I don't I, I don't want I don't like those kind of diets. Um, so. Either diet can work. It's just it's all about calories in, calories out. Honestly, there wouldn't be too much I can eat on the the carnivore diet. That it's it's not it's not very appetizing to me. All right, what's up there? Oh, we got ice cream. So what kind of ice cream is that? I don't know. Okay, so I think it's the one with the um. Yeah. Okay, it's the ice cream that looks like it's got like M and M's in it. Uh, where is it? This one right here. I'll show you the box when it gets here. I can't order it right now, but I'll show you when it gets here. Um, nobody, yeah, nobody's coming on my register. All right, fine by me. Okay, so nothing's out. Nothing's out. Oh, register. What's up, man? Oh, beer, nice. Beer, milk, and detergent. This guy's gonna exercise, get his protein through some milk, then drink a bunch of beer, and then do some laundry. I'd imagine, right? Probably. Have a nice day. Oh, man, I got to sit up in my chair. This isn't exactly a sit up in the chair situation, but I'm trying to keep better posture for my back. 
Alright, uh, looks like we need potatoes, and we'll just get six of those. Boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew, maybe, who knows. We're up to $15,000, we might actually make the 25000 today. We might actually make it, it depends. I got my fingers crossed, but man, it is, um, it's slow going. It is slow going. Let's see what the, what the, we're making on some of this stuff. Um... Oh, you're making more than double your money on the on the cakes. See, it's not so much about it's not so much about the overall cost, right? The price. It's more about this number down here. If these only cost me 67 cents and my profit's 133, that's a hell of a profit. The thing is you'd have to sell a lot of them though. That, that's the thing. Oh man, look at this. That's my girl. All right, 226 75. Hell yeah. Thank you very much. And have a good day. Your hair's still messed up, but that's okay. That is A-OK -okay by me. What about the flour? What's the profit on the flour? Yeah, almost double. Um, it cost me... Well, that's the average cost, so depends when the price goes up or goes down, but the average cost is about 360 If I'm making 340 profit, that's a nice profit. But then you have stuff like this, which is like $26.75, but you're only making $4. It cost me $22 to make it. I'm only making four sixty two. dollars So... I mean, you gotta, it costs a lot. The profit is, yeah, I don't know. It's weird. But the thing is, you don't sell a ton of items. So if you're only going to sell a couple of items, these are just as good. If you're only going to sell a couple of items, the, the highest profit is all that matters. If you're going to, if you can manage to sell a ton of items, then the average cost compared to the profit is what matters. I don't know. I'm just kind of like playing it by ear here. I don't know. I could be totally wrong about that. Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments, especially if I'm right. If I'm not right, eh, you know, you can let me know or not, you know, whatever you want to do, but. If I am right, make sure you let me know. <laughs> I like reading comments when I'm right. Not so much when I'm not right. All right, guys. Let me know in the comments right now. Uh, this day, how many red How many red things am I going to have? Um, customer found something too expensive or didn't find something they wanted. How many? I'm going to say two. Three, two, one. There you go. See? Over $5,000. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, cheese parmesan. Cheese parmesan. What's this, right? Yep. Damn, that did go up. I'm going to put that up to seven. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right, let's get this order. Let's put it away. And then uh, we're going to do another day. Ran a day and restocked. And I think I'm ready to run another day. I might have a couple key items. Yeah, I, I think I should do one more ordering. I'm trying not to order too much. I mean, I, I still stand by. It doesn't really matter because eventually you'll sell it all and you're going to get all the money. But I kind of want the money now rather than later. So I'm going to be a little bit more careful of what I buy. But I don't want to let the back run out because the back runs out. Then you got to order it all again. And it like it takes even longer the more you have to order. So everything's looking pretty good. I'm trying not to order stuff unless it's out. I accidentally bought too much beer. So that was a mistake. But, um, you know. It is what it is. So that stuff's all looking good. I'm not having anything here. I'm out of eggs. I'm out of four eggs. Four pack of eggs. Everything else seems okay. Oh, and uh, chocolate cereal. Chocolate cereal, four eggs. Um, darn it, this isn't going to work out no matter what I do. All right, let's just do two of these, and we'll do one of the cereals. And that, my friends, is going to be it. I keep saving up money, and I just spend it all. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Yeah. I just thought I'm not going to keep as much stuff back here as I thought. Because, like, especially once I start getting more licenses, I'm going to have to make more room back here. And I'm going to have to really start cutting stuff down. Like right here, bleach. I have two things of bleach that are taking up three shelves. I do, I do one per shelf, one per shelf, and then one each on the third shelf. That's got to be two shelves, right? So, like, things like that. And that'll help me order less. Like, I order, like, four things of cereal all at once. Which, um, you know, just really don't need all that. But the thing is, if I order four, I don't have to order again for a while. So, it's, you know. It's not, it's not, it's not exactly a waste of time, but... Yeah. I'd rather the money now rather than later. Because I don't even know if we're going to get to the expansion tonight. Because it's just, you know... It's taking so long. But... Ah, uh, see what? That wasn't supposed to go there. I ordered too much of it. Oh, no, it was. I'm bad. My bad. Regular bleach and new bleach. Okay, we're good. We are good. Let's get the eggs. these eggs in here. 
going to go run the cash register. We can open right now. Do this. And... Uh, nope. Like this. You know the drill. Come on. All right, cool. Put this away. And then we're just waiting for people to come in. We're looking pretty good. I don't see anything that we're out of, out of. Even, like, up here. I'm, I'm paying attention to the rice for once. Oh, juice. Apple juice. Uh, soda. You know what? I should probably set that up right now. I won't order it, though. Hey, eh, you know what? I might as well. We're out of it. If we're out of it, we need it. We're in juice. It was apple, right? Pretty sure it was apple. Wait, what? There we go. And, yeah, it was apple. Anything else? And I should probably get more of that coffee. I know it's not out, but it's going to be out pretty soon. And I got to get something else to kind of fill out that order. Someone was telling me to only... Someone was telling me to only buy four items at a time. So is it like is it really like four dollars per four items or so that's four dollars for four items. So that's the soda. If I add the juice in there, it's just another four dollars. That's not saving you any money. And I bet you I'll I'll bet you money. I'll bet you money it's a dollar shipping per item, no matter how many items you you Okay, I won't bet you money because I'm not hundred percent sure on that. But I'm pretty sure. I think it's one one dollar per item. Ten dollars. Oh, eight dollars. Ooh, okay. Hold on. All right, we'll have to mess around with that. I could, I could kind of mess around with that. Oh, it's Psycho Sid. I didn't see you yesterday, buddy. All right, you getting some beer, some ice cream, some chicken? Yeah, yeah, that checks out. Ninety seventy-five. Have a good one, Psycho Sid. Yep, he just goes out the back. He doesn't care. He's like, he's Psycho Sid. What, what do you get? Do you get tell him he can't go out the back? All right, let's see what we got here. So I want four, four, and two. Let's play around with this. Oh. Damn it, I didn't want to do that. Okay, what, what did I just delete? It was the soda, right? I'm pretty sure it was the soda. Yes. Yes, okay, let's put the soda back. Soda, and... This one? Okay. Alright, so we got... Yeah, that's good. Okay, 424. Four. Oh, so the shipping is not a dollar per item. Guys, I think you want to order six items at a time. Is it really worth it, though? If you order six items and then another four, it's four dollars. All right, so there's four items. Four items. Six items. All right, so four, four items is four dollars. And if you do another six, it's another four dollars. If you do ten, it's eight dollars. You know what? I don't think I'm going to worry about this. I think um, I'm just going to order in tens. Just, you know. <laughs> Hello, lady. How's it going? A lot of soda, some oil, some susu, rice, chocolate. All right. $112. Have a good day. I know we have to bring this stuff in. Yeah, we might as well do this. I mean, sitting there at the register waiting for people. Meh. Meh, I says. So, if I decide to get the expansion today, I probably, this will be the last day you'll see until I get the money. Because I got to go bang out some, some serious, serious cash flow. Hey, how's it going? Wow, this lady looks like the Crypt Keeper. Did I say that loud or was I thinking it? I'm going to pretend I was thinking it. I'm sorry, lady. You know what? I'm not going to look at like a spring chicken at your age either, so. That was mean. That was mean. I'm sorry. I'm going to give her a 10% discount the next time she comes to the store. Okay. People can't help their age, man. Can't help your age. It's just... The march of time will get all of us. Hey, what's going on? Oh, look at this guy. Look at this guy. Excuse me. Smile, please. Hold on. Just smile one second. You're going on the you're going on the wall. You're banned. You're absolutely banned. Get the hell out of my store. Hey, how's it going? Alright, looking good. Oh, you got those spicy chips. I'm not a fan of spicy chips myself. I do like spicy food. I like buffalo sauce, but I'm not a fan of spicy potato chips. Just, you know, not for me. 
Turco. We got some Turco soda, people. We got the Turco. Makes me think of turkey. We got turkey soda. Oh, doggy. Hold on, I'm coming. Hold on, let me turn on the light, lady. I want to get a good look at you. Hey, how's it going? Sorry if that sounded, like, inappropriate, but you're very pretty. How about that? Is that good? Can I say that? All right, have a good day. <laughs> Hello, young lady. How are you doing? Oh, darn it. I was hoping she was going to get alcohol. Because then I was going to make a joke about having to card her. Because she's so she looks so young to make up for my rudeness earlier. But I didn't get the opportunity. Have a nice day. Look at this guy. Freaking stole cold Steve Austin's in my store. I'm buying some some honeybees because stole cold said so. And that's the bottom line. I know I messed up his thing, but <laughs> he's a no nonsense kind of guy. Right, everything's looking pretty good in here. What about in the back? Um, we are going to need some cakes. Cakes. Four of those. And I'm, I'm going to wait until I run out of stuff. I know I need coffee and I know I need condiments, but I'm going to wait until I actually run out of it, run out of it. Hey, how's it going? How you doing? All right. Somebody likes tuna. There you go. Have a nice day. I think I got that blonde mixed up with that blonde. But one of them has the the butt tattoo. The other one doesn't. Right, everything's looking good here. I don't see anything that's out. Oh, chicken. Okay. All right. Chicken. I should probably just get six of that. We're hit. We're almost twenty-five thousand dollars. We should be able to hit it in this uh, in this episode, unless something crazy happens, like if a tornado hits. And I need to spend a lot of money on repairs or something like that. Um, <laughs> now, if we do do the expansion, I'm probably going to be poor afterwards because... You're on notice, bro. Don't let me catch you buying one item again. You're going on the list. Have a nice day. Alright, looking good. $87. Have a nice day. How you doing? Very good. All right, ice cream. Got a sweet tooth. Ice cream and booze. You can have some vodka ice cream bars. I love it. All right, one ninety three. Have a nice day. Pretty good there. Um, we got an order set up for twenty thousand dollars. I could just not order anything and just burn out everything in the back to get that expansion. But like I said, I don't like doing that because then when I got to catch up, it's a freaking nightmare. Absolute nightmare. All right, so we are officially out of coffee, so that's got to be next. We're talking blue and black coffee. I've got blue coffee, I've got black coffee, I've got red coffee. I don't know. One's dark roast, one's light roast. I don't give a crap. I go by color. All right, let's go. I'm going to tap dance right down. Tap, 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 -roo. tap Oh, it looked like I kicked the pizza box, didn't it? Tap, 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 -a -roo. I'm going to pretend I'm kicking their stuff. Boom. Hold on. Let's try that again. Here, here we go. Ah! Oh, I should, probably shouldn't sprint. By the way, you can hold down shift to sprint. Um, a lot of people didn't know that. So they're like, how are you moving so fast? I'm like, hold down shift. It's like, you know, holding down shift to sprint is like second nature to me. There's some video games out there. Not many. But there's been games out there I played where the sprint bu button actually makes you walk. You're sprinting normally. And if you hold and if you hold down the sprint, the, the the shift button, it makes you walk. What kind of troll job is that? Boom! Kicked your stuff. That's what I'm doing. Imagine I'm just running along and I just do a big kick. Here we go. Try again. Boom! I kicked your wine. And one more time. Ah! Ah, it didn't work out too good. Okay. That's fine. He'll be done soon. Let's take a look at the store. Everything's looking pretty good to me. Um, see, if that doesn't make you thirsty, I don't know what to tell you. Look at that. I'm freaking thirsty. Well, not pulp. That makes me think it's orange juice. I don't like orange juice. Um, Co Co 
Jima Black Goo. Black Goo. Uh, original taste, guys. It's the original taste of uh, Kojima Black Goo. <laughs> I, I, I have no words. Okay, guys, let me know in the comments. All right, you can even timestamp the video like to show which you know part of the video you're talking about. How many negatives are in this one? I'm going to say... Five. Let's go with five. Oh, okay, two. All right. Not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, olive oil. Olive oil. Olive oil. We got eight, 13. Let's go with eight, 25. Um, let's just start overcharging people. People are saying if you overcharge, you'll get people complaining, but you end up making more money anyway, which is... You know, although I think if people complain, you get less store level and I still need five store levels. So we'll see how that goes. Um, the back is looking pretty good. We do have an order here and we're going to need the coffee as well. And I think that'll be it. Coffee. Five and five. Here we go. And let me run another day and try and get to $25,000. All right, guys, let's do this. Um, I'm going to finish the day. Yeah, let's finish the day. And then we're going to buy the expansion. $5,500. Now we're starting to make some money. All right. Um, ice cream, ketchup, ice cream. Ice cream, ice cream, ketchup. Ice cream, ice cream, ketchup. Uh, I didn't catch which one was which. Uh, we're going to leave that there. Um, uh, yeah, I probably want to lower that a little bit. There we go. And that looks good to me. Actually, I might want to raise that. Yeah, we'll leave it where it is for now. Uh, and then ketchup. Now we only have one ketchup, so that shouldn't be a problem. Uh, 375. That's definitely going up to four. And let's go ahead and buy. This is going to make us poor, by the way. This is going to make us very, very poor. I can always take out a small loan if I have to, though. All right. So growth and oh, we're going to have to take out a small loan anyway. Um. Okay. Okay, bank, you win. I'm just going to take out the 750. Management, purchase. Let's see where that opens up. Oh, it did open up back here. Okay, great. Great. So it is going to open up this way, which is great. So when I eventually open up, actually, it looks like it's going to be four spots. One, two, three, four. Once I open up all four spots, I will redesign the entire store. But for now, I'm going to do like small redesigns as I open it up. So actually, this looks like it's going to work out really well. There. And then we're going to put this one right here. I don't have any money to buy any extra stuff. So we're just going to like leave it where it is. And I'll probably put, um, I'll probably move some of the shelves over here though. These two shelves can come out of here to kind of free up right over there. All right. Very good. Um, although with the door i might want these i want these to match with this because of the door so let's put them on from this side all right not perfect but pretty good go. all right that looks good i kind of want something to be over here just to kind of block this i don't know what that could be though uh i guess i could just do it with this one yeah, I'm gonna put this over here. Oh, it's not gonna fit. Crap. Yeah, I, I don't really like the way that setup is. Let's just put this back. Right, that looks good on both sides. And then we're gonna do is we're just gonna move this whole thing down. And what we'll do is we'll keep it at where it is. Oh, it's gonna be hard to keep it where it is. No, it won't be because of the the wooden floor. The wooden floor will help me line things up. Because it has lines going in the direction I'm building. Here we go. Move this down. I hate the way the door to the to the storage like makes this an issue. But eh, what are you gonna do? So I have room for a few more things if I want to if I want to put more things in here. Um, am I gonna buy more license? No, I'm not gonna buy any license till store level seventy. So. It doesn't really matter. Like, I'm not buying any more license till store level 70. All right, I'm going to... I See, I don't like being able to see back there. I mean... 
I'm gonna block this somehow. I have to. Okay. No, it's still not blocked. I guess there's no real good way to block it. Um, hold on. Ugh, that's, that doesn't look good either. All right. I'm just going to put this back. I'm going to run another day. Let's see what kind of money we can get back. Maybe pay off that loan. I really don't want I really don't want to have that loan for more than, more days than I have to. Dude, I forgot I got bills. Oh my goodness. I got bills and now I got a loan. I'm not buying any new product for a while. I'm not buying any new product for a while. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay. Well, it is what it is. We're just going to let the day run through. Ah, uh, this sucks cuz I need wine and whiskey and that stuff, you know. It ain't cheap. I got it. I got enough product though. I should be able to dig myself out of this hole. One thing that's nice is when you have a lot of product in the back and you know you're making some serious money, you can really come back from just about anything, uh, which is really awesome. I'm almost at five thousand dollars right now. Now I do have a lot of stock. You know I got to pick back up back here, but I mean honestly, it's not even that bad. There's a couple key items, you know, milk and some sodas and everything, some cereals, but shouldn't be too bad. Let's go ahead and finish the day. Okay, 4,800. Cleaner bread and chips. Cleaner bread and chips. Yeah, it's this one. Cleaner? Yeah, it looks fine. Bread? I think it was this bread. And I'm really tempted to just leave my prices high, honestly. I'm going to leave it alone the hell with it. <laughs> it wasn't this one, right? No, definitely not. And chips. Now, I don't know which chips it was, but... Let's take a look. Um, oh yeah, okay. Let's do uh, let's do seven. And this one we're also gonna do seven. There we go. Now let's get everything taken care of, and we're gonna start off by paying off that bank loan. We're gonna pay it. We're gonna go to loans, pay off early. Beautiful. That was that wasn't too bad. Cost me a couple bucks, but I got like you know, if you only need a couple bucks, not that bad. All right, let's make sure all of my bills are paid. All right, and uh, I now have $2,800 to restock. Shouldn't be that much a problem at all. Uh, the next, let's take a look at the next expansion. I think it's like $31,000. It's getting a bit much. I'm, I'm not going to lie. It, it is getting a bit much. Uh, not license, I'm sorry. Mm, growth. Yeah, $31,000. If I could just get these guys to bring the stuff in from the road, it would really, really help. Uh, and then I could just order and run the register when I want to. Um, I do have enough stuff. I already did all the... I, I went and looked at the new items. The new items are one sugar. I'm sorry. The new items are one pasta, one rice. All right? So what I could do is I could give it a salt and pepper, put that against this wall, and I'll be good to go. I could just move the whole thing out because I put salt and pepper on the same shelf. Remember when I did that? Um, I could just move this out. Although I do want the pasta to be together. So I'd have to move this out, move a fresh one in, put the rice right here. Um, take the mayo, put it right there, and then put the new pasta right there. So the pasta and the rice would be spoken for, no problem. The other thing would be sugar. Now, I, I'd have to break something up here because I've got all my sugar right here. I've got all my flour right here. I've got all my oils right here. I'd have to break something up. So I'd probably put the new sugar over here somewhere. I wouldn't, have, I wouldn't really have much of a choice with the store setup. And the other new things are cheeses. I'm, I'm guessing those would go in the fridge. Um, clotted cream? What the hell is clotted cream? I don't even know what that is. And then yogurt. Yogurt's spoken for. All I gotta do is get rid of all the butter here, since I got butter over here, and yogurt's good to go. And then I just have to make some more room for cheese. I would probably move these over here, and then put, um, move everything down, and then I'd have another two spots for cheese, which I, what I'm trying to say is the license would work out for me. I just don't know if I want to drop money on it. I don't know if it's worth it. It is $12,000, $12,500. I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments. Do you think that license is worth it? Or should I just keep expanding the store and wait for store level 70 when I can start selling books? Let me know what you think in the comments. All right, guys. I am going to call this one here. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'm trying to jump on our head. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.